girl seven here and today i have a special guest with me we have my husband dustin here with us say hello what's up <laughs> Uh, the most requested thing on my channel is to have him in my videos more often. He's not really a Pokemon fan, he doesn't really know anything about Pokemon, so I'm never sure how to incorporate him on the channel. But in today's video, we have a super cool game that we're going to play. We are going to play Guess the Shiny Pokemon. So basically, I'm going to show Hubby a picture of a normal Pokemon and its shiny form. I'm going to put them side by side, and he's going to have to guess which one of them is shiny. So for everyone that he guesses correctly, he gets a point, and everyone that he gets wrong, I get a point and at the end of the game we're gonna see who wins whoever has the most points and we also have a very special guest with us Ruger today more special than him <laughs> say hello Ruger so first off let's ask Dustin how he feels about playing this game do you think you're gonna be successful today oh yeah do you know much about Pokemon let them know like the most knowledge you have about Pokemon basically I have no knowledge he has zero knowledge not just the Pokemon but nothing in general. no just kidding guys but really Pokemon. He pretty much only knows like a little bit of Gen 1. He might know what some of the shinies from Gen 1 through 3 look like because of me playing Pokemon Go so much. I'm not sure exactly, but I tried to pick shinies that he's probably not going to be able to guess. So let's go ahead and get started and see how he does. Okay, let's start off with a Generation 3 mythical Pokemon, Jirachi. Now, which one of these do you think is shiny? Oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and you really got to think about it. Definitely the orange one. You think this one's shiny here? Oh, I know it is. You are correct on that. Yeah, That's really good. How did you know that? Because of its skin. That's crazy. Oh, because yeah. Because it's white. White's well, like a basic color. If basic it's gonna have white a, Jirachi. If it has like a basic, <laughs> like if it's white and then other Pokemon's like colored really funny, like it's obviously gonna be a shiny. So basically, Jirachi looks like it drinks Starbucks, right? It looks like it goes out and tans every other day. <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> well, that's one point for Dustin. He did really good on his first try. So there we have it. Shiny Jirachi. That's really good. Okay. Okay, next we're going to do Legendary Generation 3 Pokemon Entei. Which one is shiny? This one's really hard, actually. Yeah. <laughs> this is one of the shinies that I, I like, always had a hard time um, telling apart myself. I do know which one is which, but let's see what he thinks. <laughs> They're very similar, aren't they? <laughs> uh, Which one do you think just looks like it makes more sense, basically? <laughs> no, never. <laughs> uh, Neither one makes any sense. No, they're they're basically the same. They do look so much like. There's only one difference. Can you do see the difference? Well, there's two in them, differences. Though. Well, two differences. Yeah. The color of the fur and the star thing that's on its face. Yeah. That is. Yeah. But they're still really similar, and they neither of them look like outrageously crazy, do they? No. I'm going to assume the the one with the red. The one with the red? You think the one with the red is the shiny? Wrong! <laughs> I was going to say this, the silver one, but it's just... He's wrong. I get a point. The shiny is actually this one, which well, I think this the shiny is prettier than the normal one. I messed one. up because that's a lot of color. I don't know. I know you would think since it's like such a random color that that would mean it's yeah, shiny. Yeah, because it's random. Yeah, it's like the only red on the whole body. Yeah, that does look... I think that if I didn't know, I would probably guess that that was shiny too. But nope, it's the bottom one. I think shiny Ante is actually really beautiful. It's one of my favorite shiny So It's actually tied right now. It's one to one right now. So let's keep going. Now we have Malamar. Malamar is one of my favorite Pokemon actually. And I like its normal and its shiny form a lot. So let's see what Dustin thinks. What do you think? They're both First of all, ridiculous. what do you think Malamar looks like in real life? I have no clue. You don't think it looks like corn? I think it looks like an ear. You know which corn. one I think it is? Which one? I think the top one's shiny. You the, think the top one's the shiny? The greenish looking one. So that's your final answer? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Positive? Absolutely. He is so right! It's so shiny! <laughs> good job. That's, yeah. it, that's a good job. You, you want to know how I guessed that? What? Because it's a squid and squids are usually... Oops. Purple or pink. Oh, so okay. Yeah. So you're actually one of the people that thinks Malamar does look like a squid. When I first it's saw Malamar, a squid. that's funny. When I first saw Malamar, I thought it was an ear of corn. <laughs> How does it look like an ear of corn? I don't know. Especially at shiny, it really looks like an ear of corn. You don't see that? Here's like the the what do you call the the husk? Is that what it's called? And then like here's the hair that comes off of corn. <laughs> You don't think that looks like corn? No. <laughs> Anything looks like a green bean. That is so funny. <laughs> you did really good though. Yes, it is based off of a squid. So he even like knows Pokemon knowledge, not just which one's the shiny. So right now it's two to one. He's actually beating me right now. He's doing pretty good. So let's go ahead and move on to Sylveon. Now Sylveon is like one of my favorite Pokemon. So let's see how he does on I already this. know this one. You know this one? Yeah. What is it? Wait, no. Oh no. There, 
It, it's it's uh, shiny maybe. form looks as good as its normal form, so it's like they're both, it's hard to determine. Is the pink the shiny? Well, the... I can't tell you. <laughs> they're both really beautiful. Oh my gosh, that's really <laughs> impossible. This one is a hard one. Think about it, like, I talk about Sylveon a lot. It was in my top 10 cutest Pokemon list. I have a plushie of Sylveon. It's on my Pokemon card binder. The You've pink, seen it. Wait, so the blue one's a shiny. Oh, you think the blue one's a I shiny? I think the blue one's a shiny. He got it, you guys. Oh my God, you're doing really good at this. I shouldn't have gave you the hints about all the stuff that <laughs> well, I have. Well, no, that didn't even help. <laughs> I was just looking at it. And... The blue one does kind of look shiny. I don't know, they both look really good. Though, because you think. said you liked, you liked it before. Yeah, and you thought since it was pink, I would like it more yeah. probably. Yeah, he's right, you guys. How many is that? How many points is that now? I don't know. I'm losing track now. I think it's three to one. He has three points, and I have one point right now. He's doing really good, much better than I expected. But some of the shinies we're about to do actually don't look much different than their normal form. So let's keep going. Next, we have Regigigas, a Gen 4 legendary. Let's see how he does on this one. What is that? <laughs> Isn't it weird looking? Regigigas is, is the like master of the three Reggies. Looks like his, he looks like a toaster with a red light on him. <laughs> it does, <doesn't> it? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and he's got an outlet prong on his hand. I'm not even sure what Reggie Gigas is supposed to really be. Like, I'm not sure. He's just like the master this of the legendary Reggies. This is gonna be Reggies. a whole guess right here, but I'm gonna assume the yellow one's the shiny. You think the yellow one's the shiny? Yeah, that's the only thing I can think of. Final answer? Yeah. Wrong! Mm. Wrong. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's two to four, wait, no, two to three now. The purple one is the shiny, actually, which I kind of would have guessed the yellow, too, because shinies have yellow and gold on them a lot, usually, like, not usually, but a lot of the times. They change it from either, like, yellow to gold. But, yeah, you're wrong. <laughs> I honestly think Reggie Gigas' shiny is really cool because I love purple, so. Wrong! So, it's two to four now. He's still, wait, two to three. Oh, my God, I keep forgetting the score. It's two to three, so he's beating me by one right now, so it's a little bit close now. Maybe I'm starting to catch up. <laughs> they actually get harder and harder as we go. So let's oh, do the great. next one. I don't even know what that is at all. <laughs> Some of them like are barely different. So here we go. Cresselia. Oh, this is a pretty cool one. <laughs> Cresselia is a Gen 4 legendary. I was actually soft resetting for this in my um, Ultra Sun worm holding. Did you catch it? I ended up giving up and just catching it because I hate soft resetting because it takes forever. <laughs> Which Did one I'm... do you think looks better? Like n more normal? Oh. Looks more normal. Neither of them look normal. <laughs> one looks more normal. Hold on, They're buddy. both so pretty. I love them both. Cresselia is gorgeous. So the coolest looking one is the one with the blue. You the think the blue one? I think it looks normal or shiny. I, I think the pink one is the shiny. You think the pink's the shiny? Yeah, because you were trying so hard to get it. I'm assuming the pink one's the shiny. That's actually a good theory, but you're wrong. <laughs> yeah, the blue one is the shiny. And yeah, that's kind of why I gave up on soft resetting it because I was like, I like the normal one more because it's pink. So I was like, why am I soft resetting for this? I love normal Cresselia, but it's tied now three to three. So I'm catching up with you. That one, you are right though. The blue one looks more like cool. I think like, you just quit going away from the pink ones. <laughs> yeah, well you did good on Sylveon. You got Sylveon right, remember? You yeah. Did it. it was kind of like the same color differences too on those. So, okay, it's three to three right now, you guys. We are tied. So let's see if we can catch up. Let's go ahead and do the next one. Sweet Coon. I love this shiny. Oh my god. I already know. You know which one's shiny? Yes, the which one, one with the blues is shiny. They're both blue. No, the one with the blue cape <laughs> thing, whatever it is, it's hair, it's mane. I have no idea. I don't the, even know what. Wait, first of all, what do you think Sweet Coon's supposed to be based on by looking at this? Do you think it's a dog or a cat? It's a dad. A dad. <laughs> Everyone calls them the legendary dogs. And some people say that this is based on a, le a dog, and some people say it's based on a cat. But I just call it a beast because I don't know what it is. So you think it's just like a mixture of a dog and a cat? <laughs> okay, so you said this one on the right yeah. is the shiny. Yeah. Right? You're correct. He's right. right, you guys. And apparently Suicune is a dat, and the shiny dat is blue, no dat, purple. Dat. <laughs> <laughs> I love both uh, Suicune and shiny Suicune, so. He did really good on that one though, because uh, a lot of people actually don't know what Shiny Suicune looks like. So that was a good one. I thought you would get that one wrong. So, okay, let's move on to the next one. Wait, wait, that means it's three to four now, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's three to four now. Oh, he's beating me. Okay, let's move on to another Generation 4 Legendary. I've noticed I put a lot of Gen 3 and 4 on here. So here we go Giratina. It's a ghost type Legendary. It's uh -huh. awesome. Think about it. Dude. It's really cool. I love this one so much. 
I can't wait for it to come out in Pokemon Go. Where's Gen 4? Anyways. Well, it's obviously <laughs> going to be the one with the gold on it. It's the shiny. You think the bottom one is the shiny? Yeah. Wrong. Nope. What? Shiny Giratina is the blue. Actually. You said you were excited for the shiny to come out. And I was I, like. No, I mean, I'm excited for That's this. so cool. No, looking. I'm excited for that Pokemon to come out in Pokemon Go. Well, Gen that's 4. not fair. Think. Gen 4 is not out in Pokemon Go yet. I know. <laughs> you think I'd be more excited for that one though? Yeah, look at it. No, I think Shiny Giratina is way cooler. The blue, I think it's way better. No, how the heck do you think that? I love it. I don't know. I've always gold, wanted to Shiny Hunt that. Gold and red together is awesome. Yeah, normal Giratina actually is really cool. But That's like way cooler than this. Well, shiny. I think normally when I have like a favorite Pokemon, I just like it shiny form no matter what it looks like. And this is one of my favorites. It's like they put paint stripper on it for that one. <laughs> it kind of does look like that. It's kind of faded. I kind of hate when they like fade out the color on a shiny. But you were wrong, so now it's four to four, so we're tied again. This is a close game right now. I don't now. like this game. <laughs> well, you're doing better than I thought. He thought he was gonna do really bad, so. So far, so good. So, four to four, let's keep going. Let's see, knocked out. Ooh, this actually made an appearance in the anime series, so a lot of people think the shiny knocked out is the normal knocked out. So I'm gonna let you decide. You probably haven't even seen the anime anyway, but this one's a hard one, actually, in my opinion, so. Then I choose the one that's brown. You think the brown one's what? It's the shiny. You think the one on the right is shiny? Yep. Wrong! What? <laughs> it's this one! This one right here. How's that okay. hard? That looks like a regular owl. What? I'm done listening. What? The one on you're the gonna, left looks like a regular owl? Really... It's gold! No, the one on the right looks like a regular owl. Yeah, but you said the one on the right looks is the shiny one. Yeah, I know. So you think a regular because owl is shiny? Because you were like, shiny? you said they released it. <laughs> no, I played a mind that. trick on him. <laughs> Okay, see, this one in the anime, um, Ash had a shiny knocked out in the anime, but it was never really, like, addressed. So, no one really knew that that was a shiny knocked out. Everyone thought that was, like, normal or whatever, but that's actually the shiny. So. Our dog farted. Did <laughs> he? Oh, my God. It smells so bad. <laughs> this is what we God. deal with. Oh, my God, it does stink really bad. That's bad. <laughs> this is what we deal with while we're filming. Ruger. He's hiding his face. He doesn't want to be on video oh, it stinks. <laughs> it does stink. Come on. Oh, my God. What's the score now? Five to four. I have five now. You have four. Huh? You're winning. I want. I'm winning by one right now. Yeah, it keeps going back and forth. So it's five to four. He guessed wrong on the shiny knocked out. So let's go ahead and move on to the next one. Oh my God, Ruger's far. <laughs> okay, Trico, a Generation Three starter. That's I think you might be able to get this one. No, oh, it's a Gen Three starter. Keep that in mind. Okay. Why are you hiding this? You ready? Because I'm curious. Oh, that is a shiny. The blue one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm just gonna go ahead and give him that. That one's obvious. I mean, why would you guess that? Like, well, because that just looks. Have you ever seen a lizard that's like <laughs> baby blue? Well, like it's right a grass type now? starter, so obviously it's gonna be green, right? Oh, like I knew it was a grass top. Well, I mean, <laughs> you know, there's a fire, grass, and water. Oh, it could have been the water type yeah, starter cause because it's a that's a salamander. Oh, it looks yeah. like a salamander or some. Oh, gecko is what's supposed to be like a tree coat yeah. gecko. Yeah. So now it's five to five. We're actually tied again. Oh my god, it's going back and forth a lot. I didn't want to stay on that one long because honestly, I figured he would get that one. So let's go ahead and move on to the next one. Ooh, I think you might get this one. This is a kind of popular Pokemon. It's from Generation One, and it's one of my favorite shinies. And I feel like it's a little bit obvious. I shouldn't have done this one, but I really love this shiny, so I had to put it in the video. So go ahead, shiny nine tails. Which one's which? Oh, I wonder. <laughs> I really don't know. You don't know? Uh, Everyone knows. It. You remember this from your childhood, right? Yeah, and it was always. The, that one that was on the TV or whatever. Yeah. So the purple one's a shiny. So the purple bluish one yeah. is shiny on the bottom? Yeah. You're right. <laughs> Unfortunately, I didn't get a point. I yet. remember seeing it running really yeah. fast it's across majestic. the screen. It has nine tails. I mean, how could you forget it? <laughs> it's beautiful, honestly. Don't you think that's a pretty shiny, though? Like, it's a fire type, so it normally has, like, orange tips. But it looks like a husky. Like, I love husky. I know. It's gorgeous. Huskies are it? awesome. I love it. I think it's beautiful. And actually, like, um, you don't know what a Lola Ninetail looks like either, do you? It's an ice type, and it's, like, really pretty. It's, like, a white color, and it's a fairy, uh, a fairy ice type. It's beautiful. I could ruin you right now. <laughs> what? The picture that's going to be right here. Oh my god, what are you going to put right there? What are you going to put there? That, that one you were talking oh about, the low one for Oh, and I know you we're going to do that. <laughs> okay, uh, so he is right. What is the score now? Five to six? Okay, so he got the shiny non-tails right, so it's five to six right now. He's actually still winning. He's doing a really good job. I'm actually like proud of him, but almost a little bit nervous because I really want to win this. So let's move on to the next one. 
Oh, this is a good one. You're not gonna know this one. Like, this is a gener Generation 5 Pokemon, and you probably don't even know what it is. At I still all. have a 50 50 chance, so. A 50 50 chance? <laughs> oh my gosh, who knows what's gonna happen? Okay. You don't know anything about Gen 5. I barely know anything about Gen 5, so. This is a Gen 5 Pokemon. Guess the shiny Pancham. <laughs> I think this one's very hard to, to, to guess. Like, they both look like just normal to me. Neither of them look extravagant. I think I think the one that's a little bit more reddish is the shiny. So the one on the right you think is shiny? Yeah. You're right! God, oh, why? Right. <laughs> you it's are like you're right. Wrong. What was your reasoning for that? Because it's red. Have you ever seen a pan? Well they do have a red panda. A red panda. They do have. <laughs> yeah. Who's they? Who has a red panda? <laughs> They're rare. There is such thing as a red panda, yes. There's actually a Pokemon based on a red panda. It's They're going extinct. So if you want to save the pandas, you have to like this video and share it. <laughs> and you have to subscribe if you're new. For every ad watched, 50 cents goes to a Pancham around the world. <laughs> Shut up. We know we can't do that. <laughs> it's for the ads. All we gotta do is watch an ad. <laughs> That's so funny. But yes, he is correct on the shiny Pancham. So now it's 7 to 5. Hubby's still winning. I can't believe this right now. This is crazy. I'm not sure how many we have left, but I think we have quite a few. So let's move on to the next one. Ooh, Salamence. You're gonna get this one. I feel like this one's kind of obvious, but I'll go ahead and let you guess the Salamence. I have one of these in Pokemon Go. The so. green one's the shiny one. The green one. The green one. <laughs> one Lightning right there. The green one at the bottom? Yeah. You think it's shiny? Yeah. What's your reasoning behind that? Because it's lime green. Lime green. You lime green. You've green Pokemon before. Lime action. Okay, yeah, you're right. <laughs> It's five to eight now. He's right. The green one is the, is the shiny Salamence. It's the plague of the green shinies. A lot of people hate when they like make shinies green, but this Salamence is like my favorite green shiny probably out of all of them. I think it's cool. Don't you think that's awesome? A lot of people are like, ooh, I don't like green shinies. I think it's awesome. What do you think? Which one do you like out of the two? I don't know. I wouldn't want, I don't like either one of them. You don't like either of these? No. Be like that's the most coolest Pokemon ever. Are you serious? It <laughs> looks like cool. a catfish with legs. Uh, uh, <laughs> it does. <laughs> How could you say that about Salamence? Look at it. He's not allowed in this community any longer. No oh. more videos with Hubby. Goodbye. I'm just kidding. You, you saw the one I like. I like that one with the golden red. That's the sick. Giratina. Yeah, that yeah. was cool. Did you know it's a bug ghost type? That's a bug? Yeah, it's, it's like a, a centipede bug. ghost, basically. Imagine that crawling through the cracks of your house. <laughs> That's scary. <laughs> and if it's a ghost, I'd be like, ooh. What sound does it make? What sound does it make? I have no idea. Probably, <laughs> I have no idea what it does, but I don't think it does that. We should play Giratina's noise now. Do you want to? And we're going to do that right here. Let's do it right now. I'm going to get Giratina's noise. Giratina cry. If it goes, and Dustin gets a bonus point. Oh my god, here we go. You ready? It does! I did. It, does. it does! It goes <laughs> Do your noise you did. I can't. Do it again. That's like a one-off thing. I can't do that okay, again. Okay, let's, let's see how similar it was. That was yeah, exactly like, that's what, like you exactly did. what I did. So. so predictable. He's literally a Pokemon master and he's never played a Pokemon game in his life. Okay, the score is five to eight. He's doing a really good job. I'm three behind now. It's starting to get a little bit sketchy now, so I'm getting worried. So literally two more, and I'll I'll, I'll be at least tied if you got them all right after I get two more. Oh, right. oh. then we'd have to do a tiebreaker. Ooh, I like that challenge. Yeah, so. I would pick something that you wouldn't be able. You're to not going to beat me. I'm, gonna I'm really bad at picking out shinies. Anyways, let's move on to the next shiny. Ooh, Reshiram. I think this one. Actually, now that I'm looking at it. I don't think it's that hard to guess now, but we'll go ahead and see what he says. Reshiram, Gen 5 Legendary. No. I used to think this was a really hard one to tell the difference. For some reason, when I was softly saying for it, but once you see it, you like kind of can figure it out. What do you mean? I don't. Like, this is an odd looking. What do you mean? It's ugly, isn't it? It is. It looks like a poodle with wings to me, at least. I think the one with the gold rings is a shiny. So you think the one at the bottom is a shiny? Yeah, I'm just gonna go with that. Ding, 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 ding. You're correct. You are right. Pretty much not go for gold when you're guessing a shiny. Man, right? You only got five right, right? I only have five, so it's five to nine right now. Oh, man. He's doing really good. For some reason, I keep thinking these shinies are easy. I mean, are not easy to guess, but actually, 
anytime there's gold, you can pretty much guess it's a shiny. Pretty much. So, five to nine right now. He got that one right. You're doing such a good job. And I got the bonus screech. <laughs> bonus points for him. You're a team of screech. Okay, this one's my low tick. Do you know what my low tick is? Sounds familiar. I feel like he's going to know this one just because I like this Pokemon a lot. But let's go ahead and my low tick. The <laughs> oh, man. They're both beautiful, aren't they? The, the pink is the shiny. So you think the pink and blue is shiny wait. at the bottom, right? Mm, wait a minute. I don't know. <laughs> Our, that's in Pokemon Go. Wait. It what? is in Pokemon Go. It's what? Generation 3. I can't remember if... I was showing I my friend earlier I have a maxed out one in Pokemon Go. I don't know. I've loved this Pokemon since I was 12 years old. It's one of my favorites. The yellow one looks so much better. This one at the top? It looks so good. The well, bottom's the shiny. The shinies don't always look better. The pink's the shiny. So you think the bottom one's the shiny? Yeah. You wrong. No. Really? You think that my favorite Pokemon? Well, actually, they're both beautiful. You know, they both look gorgeous. You know what? I said it was shiny. If you look, at a glare coming off of it. It does. It was shiny, so I was That's like, just the picture, though. But he's right. It does. It has a glare coming off of it. It's like, oh. It's literally shiny. Literally, I don't know why they call it different cool. colored Pokemon shiny. I guess because the sparkle animation shows up in the game, but they're not literally shiny. So. Could be wet. But, oh, you're right. It is a water type, so. Don't you think this looks... What types do you think this is besides water? What's its other type? If you even remember any types. It looks like a snake. A snake. I'm <laughs> it looks a snake. Like a snake. No, it's actually just a pure water type, but I always thought it should be a water dragon. Type. Then why'd you ask me if it no, was anything else? Because I'm saying, like, wouldn't you think it would be a dragon, like a water dragon? Or it's like it's like the generation the, three version of Gyarados. And Gyarados the, isn't a dragon either. All the dragons I know fly. So it doesn't look like it can uh, fly. Well, I always thought it looks like a water dragon. It's like a Loch Ness monster. Come on. Okay, anyways. Sticking but yeah. He's wrong, so it's 629. And actually, uh, I think Shiny Melotic is just as beautiful as the normal. So I feel like he would think the shiny is prettier than this one. Right? Yeah, I thought the yellow one was like way cooler. That's why you had a hard time. Okay. It's six to nine now. Mm -hmm. We're getting close. I don't know how close we are to the end. So I'm curious to see how this is going to play out. Let's go ahead and do Generation 4 oh, Bidoof. Wow. This one's a, a Bidoof. hard one. What? I think Bidoof is a hard one. How's that a hard one? I mean, which one do you think shiny? I don't know. <laughs> I, think, I always thought this was I think the one. one on top's the shiny. You think the one on top's the shiny? Yeah. You're right. Oh, you're right. I guess because you think it's gold, right? It's like, I don't know, it looks a little, like a more common color on the bottom. Yeah, you're right. I always thought they were hard to tell the difference, well, though, on Well, you still encounter. have a chance. We can still be tied. Yeah. I'm not sure how many more we have left. Well, we'll but see. we're at 16 now, so we have four left, right? Mm -hmm. So it's 6 to 10 now? Was that your 10th one? Yeah. yeah. 6 to 10 now. He is right though. The top one is the shiny. I always thought this was, this one was a hard one to determine when you encounter it. But like side by side, they're not that hard. But imagine like just randomly encountering it. You probably wouldn't notice it's shiny when you first look at it. Corey Zambini actually found a shiny um, Bibarel, which is an evolved form of this. So shout out to Corey. I thought that was awesome. Anyways, 6 to 10 right now. Let's go to the next one. I put this, this one. This I already saw it. It's obvious as hey. Uh, I put this one in the oh video gosh. because he said he wanted Shiny Pidgey in Pokemon Go as a joke and it's become like a meme oh. on my channel. Everyone's always talking about Shiny Pidgey because of you now. Pidgey. So, okay, which one's Shiny? Hmm. Hmm. Think about it hard though. Don't just take, don't take the easy route. I, I shouldn't have put this I one on I never, here. I don't know. That's such a hard one. Are you being sarcastic? Uh. <laughs> Uh, no, it's not the top one. Mm. I think it's the, the one that's like dang green, maybe. <laughs> the, green, the green one is shiny. You're wrong. Oh, I knew it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's 6 to 11. He's right. I had to put this one on here because it's a meme. But honestly, I, I don't think... Okay, if you looked at it like without looking at that one, wouldn't you think that's just kind of normal? Uh, kind of looks green. It, I've never it really looks like seen Pidgey with the bird flu. I've never seen a green. <laughs> okay, it's six to eleven now. You're doing really. I don't think I can even catch up at this point. Can nope. I? And I got the bonus bonus screech. Oh. Bonus meme. Okay, we're done. <laughs> okay. That's the bonus meme. Let's go to the next one. God. I already know this you one. You know too. this one too? Yeah. Togepi. Oh my god, which one is it? Ah. The top ones are shiny. You're wrong. No, I'm not. You're wrong. No, I'm not. That, that's not. No. Nope. That's a shiny. It's, mm -mm. it's orange. 
You're wrong. It's, it's still orange. on the bottom. Nope. Okay. <laughs> okay, he's right. You can take that point. I'll still The Togepi win. on the top is shiny. He's mm. doing really good. You know more about Pokemon than you, you realize, I think. I know I know quite a bit about it. You were scared when we first started. You I thought you were going to get it all wrong. Because you said you got stuff that I've never seen. <sighs> I didn't know you were that familiar with it. You know I it. actually do pay attention when you play. She you acts like I don't. <laughs> when he used to stare at my screen, he doesn't play Pokemon Go at all for you guys that don't know, so I didn't know he like knew things about these Pokemon. <laughs> and this is actually on the back of my phone, I just realized. I have a Togepi well, on the back seen, of my other phone. I remember that was like one of your first big videos was catching a Togepi. You can't catch Togepi in Pokemon no, Go, you liar! You it, I hatched it, what the heck okay, How it? weird is it that you hatch it and it still has an egg, another egg around it when it comes out? You it's hatch good. it out as an egg and it's still in an egg. Well, it doesn't want to be naked. But it's a, a whole different egg. It doesn't make any sense. Togepi does not make any sense. We're going to make a whole video about it. Okay. okay, so it's 6 to 13 now. He's literally beating, like, beating me by double. Like, what the heck? Oh, yeah, over that. I haven't got a point in a really long time. So, let's go to the next one. Ooh, one of my favorite Generation 7 Pokemon. Please. It's a ghost type. It's one of my favorites, of course. So, Mimikyu. You know I love oh, this no. one. Mimikyu is one of the coolest Pokemon. I think the one on the left is so shiny. You think the one on the left is so shiny? Yep. Why do you think that? Because it's like just completely plain to Wouldn't you think this would be shiny because? No, because it has like too many. I'm angry. Color. They like black and white in it and then made it a yeah, shiny. Because it's a ghost. It's like because they got lazy. They didn't want to put any color in it. So they were like, oh, let's just put it in a black and white picture. And there's a shiny. <laughs> seriously, probably That's what, what they happened. did because they got lazy. <laughs> That's seriously, probably what happened. It's like Niantic in the cell phone towers. Basically. <laughs> Oh my god. Keep it simple, stupid. No, I'm just kidding. No, really, he's right, guys. It's 6 to 14 now. He has a good way of choosing these. Like, I feel like most people wouldn't think the way he does. But yeah, you're right. Wait, if it's 6 to 14, that means that should be the last one. Was this the last one? Wait. No, I have one more. Oh, there's one more. Oh. Bonus shiny. Okay, so this is the very last shiny. We're already... You know what? Let's say it's 6 to 14 right now. Let's say... If I, if you don't get this right, I win the whole game. No, that's terrible. <laughs> 31. <laughs> okay. And I got the sound of that since thing, the he's, screen. Since so. it's 6 of 14 and he's done a good job, this is going to be our bonus shiny, like he said. So, this is one of my favorite Pokemon that I've been using a lot in Pokemon Sun and Moon. So, I don't know if he's familiar with this one or not, though, because I haven't really showed him ever. So, let's go ahead and see if he can guess the final shiny, bonus shiny. I'm going to assume door. the one that's red the shiny. So you think the one at the top is shiny? Yes. Wrong! Uh -huh. Yay! I finally got another point. 7 to 14, even though he wins. Um, shiny Bulldor is actually at the bottom. It's more of a purple color with blue rocks coming out. Listen, you only did half as bad as me. That's true. <laughs> 7 to 14. That's pretty bad. But, God, he really did do a good job. So, how do you feel about your shiny adventure? Did you do better than you thought you would? I actually did. He did so much better than I thought he would, and before we started the video, he's like, I'm not going to know anything about this, but he did a great job. So, guys, I guess that wraps it up for today's video. Uh, let me know in the comments down below if you guys enjoy videos like this, and do you want to be in videos like this more often? Because I want It doesn't bother me. It was really fun, wasn't it? Yeah. Did you enjoy doing it? I did. <laughs> you did a really and good And you know job. what I think they should do? What? I think they should all subscribe to my channel. You guys should go subscribe to Dustin's <laughs> channel, actually. He has a channel named Dustin Does It. I'll put the link to his channel in the description. He does gaming videos, and he's wanting to get that started up. He's trying to kind of come up with new creative ideas and new games to play. So definitely go check him out. I think he reached 100 subscribers, actually. Yeah, so you guys can go check him out and show him some love. And also subscribe to this channel if you guys are just now coming in. Make sure you smash that like button and also hit the notification bell button so you know when we post new videos. And I guess that's all for the video. So, say your goodbyes. Punch that like button in the face oh like a boss. And, whoosh, whoosh, that's not right. High fives all around. We're not Jacksepticeye. <laughs>